Um, thank you. That was an um to introduce you. Um, hello, that was an um to say hello from I Promenade. This is a place I've shown you from Het Steen and Hoof, the Stony Head. And the I Promenade is this escape spot, as you see, it's, you really have a lot of space. And the spot of spots on the I Promenade is actually over there. Now, the whole thing about this, this place, it used to be quite secluded. But as Amsterdam has welcomed more and more visitors, they find places to escape. And this is one of the places they come or Amsterdam has come here. And the trick, the trick is to get here on time and to get to the spot of spots. And that's where we're walking towards right now. Now, the thing about the spot of spots, people love it. And there is a, there is a general code that if you're sitting there, people cannot sit that close to you. It's just this, it's not a written law, but it's just human decency. Um, see, there's another um. Uh, one, one thing I can say about this, is we are getting a bit ruffian-like in our behavior, at least when it comes to spots. Last summer, there were a number of occasions when I came to this spot, sat down, and other people came and sat near me. The usual method I use to keep people away is to put on what I call an attitude face. An attitude face is one of those faces that says, leave me alone, I'm incredibly dangerous. It works sometimes, but most of the time it doesn't work, at least since last year. People come and smile and chat to you, which is, which is very nice. But I usually come here. I come here to this spot that you see down there. That, there it is. There's the spot. And we're actually going to sort of zoom in. You see, maybe you see a little heart. So I come to this spot, and I'm sitting, and I'm looking out to the world with my yellow pad and pen, doing some work, and people come and start chatting. And what can you do? You know, you can't tell them to go away because they're being really nice and really friendly. So I'm going to work on something so that by the next summer, by this coming summer, summer 2019, I've developed a technique that keeps people away from me, but in a very, very friendly fashion. Right now, what we're staring at is a, a ferry. It's a, a yellow one. It's yellow because of Access for All. Access for All is an internet provider. They were one of the first internet providers. You, I think you used to have um, NLNet and Euronet and all those things. Way, way back when internet suddenly began to explode and people described it as this new economy and something great was going to happen. Those who are old enough will know about the dot-com bubble. A lot of things burst, but Access will survive and that's why they can stick um, their colors on a ferry. The ferries, as you see, are usually blue and white, like the other one there going in the opposite direction so here I'm gonna ah yeah let's look at a few, a few other things so way in the distance you see a number of cranes and the fattest crane of all which is almost in the center of the image slightly off center to the right that crane has just been there for ages it, it used to uh, NDSM that's that area over there and it's building up incredibly quickly and that's where they used to build ships um, Times have changed, no ships are built there at all. Though you do have a lot of artists and some really nice festivals uh, during the year showing that. Moving slightly to the right, you see this big boat in front. What happens behind that squarish building or somewhere over there, there's this crane that appears out of nowhere and starts taking stuff off the ships and putting it into a little, well, into something anyway. But it's not working right now. I think that's because it's holiday season or almost new year so we're mellow and quiet and not doing that much i think i feel another um coming on so i'm gonna um oh, that was a great um what 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 is possible actually on the um mat, the matter of ums is that i believe ums can be graded graded uh, according to intensity the rhythm uh, resonance perhaps there, there are many ways to grade ums 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 are a valuable part of life and i think ums are going to be an integral part of this Amsterdamica vlog. So, the, I believe I've just done a 360 uh, inadvertently, but I'm turning around. As I turn around, this is hopefully getting me... Um, see, there's another um. 
<laughs> it's hopefully getting me, uh, charging my brain up with some good idea, something wonderful to tell you. Ah, yeah, I got it. Freedom, 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 freedom. One of the reasons I come here is freedom, but on this subject of freedom, this Amsterdamica vlog has something to do with freedom in the sense that I'm now talking and just saying what I feel like. Hopefully something at least that isn't painful to listen to. And that, that, that demands a certain freedom. I'm not one of the, I'm, I'm from an older generation, so I'm not somebody who grew up talking in public. I'm not somebody who grew up telling the world about what I was up to. And yet there is something pleasant about that. I'm not saying it's wrong. And in order to do that, you need to become free. So I have to let go of all those things like, oh, what are they going to think? Or what is this person going to think? Or is this right? Blah, 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 blah. Or are you not too old for this? And on and on and on. So I, 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 I'm using this to help myself get a little freer. I, I don't think I'll tell... I'm not going to say weird stuff. I'm not going to say, oh, hey, this is a vlog full of weird stuff and crazy stuff. No, it's just a vlog full of just thinking and looking at Amsterdam. Presently, Gray, I trust you. I trust you. It will get sunny at some point. Also, something else that's going to happen is right now the first ones are away from most people. And there's a good reason for that. That's called chickenitis. I'm not yet ready to wander through people or wander through crowds and poke my phone camera in their faces. But that will come, that will come. I will, I will improve, I will become more relaxed, I'll become more free, and you'll see all kinds of wonderful things. Final note for today, or for now, is on my way here, I did think about making these exceptional camera moves, sort of learning to sort of swing the camera around and you'd all be impressed and say, my goodness, look at that shot, look at that shot. But I, I chose not to do that because there is a danger I would fall and that would just be embarrassing since I have promised myself not to edit anything out of what I'm doing here. It is what it is, and that's that. So, from I Promenade, you're looking uh, back towards the city. Central Station is there again. This is the Shell Building, and this big, mo well, it's not monolith, but this is big brown structure. And there's some crazy gadget thing. I don't know what they do with that, but something happens in that towery thing, which is now on the right. So from this place, I promenade, I'm going to say goodbye. But I'm not going to say goodbye yet, because I suddenly thought of something. You see that chimney over there, way, way over there, puffing away as it does, smoke or steam billowing out of it. It's a chimney you see from all over Amsterdam. So we'll visit it uh, at some t uh, point in the future. Until then, or until the next edition, or whatever we want to call it, we're going to look at this boat, watch this boat slowly crossing from left to right. It's a blue boat, as you see. It's called Weibo or Wabo or whatever it's called. It's um, Maybe it's a nice boat. I don't know. I'm not a boat person. I don't have that expertise. When I do find information about boats, I will pass that information on to you, unfiltered. Yeah. So again, goodbye from now, goodbye from here.